from VOA Learning English. This is the Technology Report in Special English. The technology company Apple introduced one of the most anticipated products of the year, the new iPhone 5 in September. The new smartphone went on sale in the United States and other countries with very strong interest among consumers. The first iPhone was introduced in 2007. Now, the newest iPhone promises to be in great demand, judging from public reaction to the product's release. Huge lines formed outside Apple stores from Munich, Germany's capital, to Hong Kong on the day of the iPhone's release. The iPhone 5 went on sale in nine countries in mid-September. Images of long lines have become a familiar sight when Apple launches new products. But most people avoided the long lines. The new iPhone has a larger screen, thinner body, and faster processor. It also connects to faster communications networks. But there have been complaints about some new features. Some say the iPhone 5's new mapping system has problems. The new system is meant to replace Google Maps. And some people are unhappy about the new connector that goes with the iPhone 5. Now, owners will have to buy new connectors and devices like chargers that are designed only to work with their new phone. Apple expects to be selling new iPhones in 100 countries by the end of the year. The world's most valuable technology company sold 5 million iPhone 5s within the first two weeks. But problems at the factory in Taiwan, China, where iPhones are made, have raised questions about supply. Experts expect Apple to sell at least 50 million new iPhones by the end of the year. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.